everyone. Welcome to the Desert Museum. Today I'm going to introduce you to one of the animals that is quite common in our state, but a lot of people have never seen them. And this animal is called a ringtail. You might have heard her referred to as a ringtail cat, a miner's cat, a ringtail raccoon, and actually none of those are correct. She is a ringtail. Now ringtails are found all throughout the state of Arizona. They like to have fresh running water. So places like our riparian areas, Sabino Canyon, the Grand Canyon, those are all very common places to find them. They like to have rocky areas. She'll spend her daytime hours sleeping because she is nocturnal. And she'll sleep inside these rock caverns. When it's time for her to have her baby, she'll also den in a rocky area. Now ringtails generally are solitary. You'll find females uh, raising their offspring. The males don't help out very much. When the babies are about six or seven months old, they'll be off on their own. And the, then they're, they're solitary once again. Now when the sun sets, that's when she wakes up and starts looking for her food. Now, let's look at her body. She's got big ears. Those ears will rotate independently, so one can point forward and one can point backward. That helps her hear not only the food she wants to eat, but perhaps a predator, like a great horned owl, that might want to come and eat her. She also has really big eyes. Take a look at those. Those big eyes will help her to see her food that she wants to eat. And look at the white rings. Now most of us think about putting black underneath our eyes or wearing sunglasses. It accomplishes the same thing, keeping the light out. The white rings around her eyes will help reflect the moonlight and the starlight into her eyes and help her see much better. She's got a nose that she uses quite frequently to smell up sweet treats. And those whiskers on her face help her feel as well. And look at her camouflage. You can see she has this black and white ring tail. It's not used for hanging from anything. It is used for balance when she's hopping around on her rock walls. Now let's go back to her diet. I mentioned all those great things about her face. She loves to eat birds, birds and bird eggs. She likes mice and bugs. She loves sweet treats, who doesn't? So cactus fruit, cactus flowers, berries, honey, and I happen to have a grape in this pouch of mine and we'll see what she likes to do. Look at those big teeth. Those big teeth are fabulous for breaking open bird eggs and crunching through the bones of the meat she eats. And she's got that long tongue to make sure she laps up all of the juice. So when you're out with your family in one of our riparian areas or out for a hike at night, keep your eyes open and keep your ears open and maybe you'll be lucky enough to spot the Arizona state mammal, the ringtail.